Qigong felt as if it's calming me down. I'm quite a doer, a boom, boom, boom person. And so always on to the next thing, um, never in the present moment. So the Qigong really seemed to allow me to be in the present moment while I do it. So moving from my home country, um, South Tyrol in Italy, to New Zealand was actually a very exciting event for me because I moved there because of love. So coming here to New Zealand and starting something new was amazing. And because I love teaching, I'm, I think I'm born to be a teacher <laughs> because I talked since I'm 14. I started to teach skiing to little children when I was 14. And ever since I teach, I was teaching all sorts of things. And I have always been searching for something that really felt like it's fulfilling me as a teacher. So while I did uh, teach lots of movements and sports, um, nothing really grabbed me. And then I became a yoga teacher and that didn't really feel 100% me. And then I discovered Yuan Gong and that was it. And so Qigong was my, let's say, restart into a more growth orientated method because yoga was too. Pilates is more a body thing. And then I could feel that there is something missing for me. Um, I was my whole life also on a path of searching for a growth path which works for me and Yuan Gong Rain Shui is definitely the path which works for me. Um, I had a studio, a Pilates studio in Wellington for about seven years and in the beginning of when I owned the studio, um, as Pilates teachers in the region, we always caught up every couple of months and did something together, a bit of networking and just having some fun. And one of the Pilates teachers started Qigong and she introduced us one month to her Qigong teacher, Rachel. And so I experienced Qigong um, as a one hour session and I thought, well, there is more to this for me to find out about. And so I signed up for a workshop and everything else is history. <laughs> now I'm myself a, a Qigong teacher. In the beginning, it felt all too slow for me, but um, with practice, I really started to enjoy and appreciate the benefits of that slowing down. And then with starting the teacher training, I just realized, wow, there is a whole other world for me to discover on the path of growth. So it's not just movement. It's not just feeling relaxed. This can teach me more. This can teach me to connect to my heart. This can teach me to feel better by transforming myself because we all made the experience that trying to change the outside world does not work. I tried really hard, <laughs> but um, so, wow, it's so empowering. I find it very empowering. So teaching for me was always very enjoyable when I had people in front of me who were open to be taught. And when you have that openness in front of you, then when you're passionate about what you teach, it's like a meditation. You're in the present moment. You share what you're passionate about with somebody else. And when you do it that way, it comes across, I think in a way that people really listen and are able to open up to it. So there's nothing fake about when I'm able to teach 
in an environment where people are there because of them choosing there to be there. So it's very, very enjoyable. It's a giving and a taking. It's like the gratitude, you know, it's a receiving and a giving. So when I give what I know and what I believe in and what I'm passionate about, I receive a lot back too. I receive that feeling of being able to help somebody and also to, to make a difference, to make a difference to people's life. What is very beautiful about teaching, for me, teaching Qigong, actually anything I teach, is that every time I teach, I practice. Because when I teach, I have to be in the present moment. I can't be with my thoughts somewhere else in the future or in the past. So it's a practice. And so I grow while I teach also in the interaction with people. And at the same time, I can help people with what I know, with sharing what I know for them to have an experience of growth. So it's kind of a back and forward change. Zidu, Duren, both ways actually. <laughs>